Okay, I'm going to try this at about 60% so it gives you something really to aim for. Okay, so if it's a little too fast, you know, go back to the old videos and work through it. Remember, as uh, before we get into it, that the chorus is simply going from your first chord shape, okay, down to the second chord shape, okay, then we're going to what I call the fourth chord shape to the third. With your pinky or third finger if you want to give it give your pinky a rest you can always switch to the third finger when you're doing the half step away shapes versus these with the whole step and switch to the pinky for that that can be complicated let's give this a try this part you already know but if you need some help with this, go back to your old video. Maybe warm up with that. And then jump into this one. Stay on this, going into the chorus. One and two and three and four and. to the verse. Stay here as a pre chorus. Up to the first chord. Stay here. I never should have told it. I never should have left to see inside. I don't want and then we're, let me pause it right there. We're going to be up to, if you're counting frets, this is the 12th fret, 13, 14. So we've got fret 14 right here, and we're going to be up to fret 16 here with the pinky. Now, as I said before in your lesson, you can just play 
uh, an open string three, which is the G string, and uh, then uh, fret 16 here of the B string, if you want to, or like this. Okay, so it will go like this. Okay, fret three index from the capo. Sorry, didn't get, grab that one. Let's try on that bridge. Here we go. That's it. Okay, he's got this little arpeggio he's going to do at the end there. I'll show you that next time. But keep working on it.